Tell me a little bit about your background, because a lot of folks here uh, might not know you, but you're very excited about this, and I saw that you get to play a cool character in this. So tell us, uh, tell us a little about the film and your involvement in it. Well, I um, get to play one of the witches. It's uh, Dorothy and the Witches of Oz. It's a modern retelling of the Witches of Oz story. And um, so, yeah, we shot it in Connecticut, which is where I actually grew up. Um, I'm living out in Los Angeles now. Um, and uh, it's a great production. It's, you know, a non-studio uh, film that's really, um, I think, turning some heads with the studios because it's doing the unthinkable, going to theaters, you know, without any studio backing. And it, the production value is unbelievable on this movie, and the cast is great. Um, you know, Christopher Lloyd's in it, Billy Boyd. Lance Hendrickson, um, Sean Astin, Mia Sarah, who is in Ferris Bueller's Day Off. I have scenes with her. Um, and so it's a fantastic family film. And um, I got to play an evil witch in it, <laughs> which was a lot of fun because I'm, uh, I'm not an evil person. <laughs> so playing one is really fun. Um, but, yeah, we're opening up at Harkin Theaters um, uh, on Friday. And there's going to be a big uh, star-studded premiere at the Super Street Superstition Springs location. Well, it's very exciting because we see more and more films coming out now that don't necessarily have the backing of the big boys in Hollywood, uh, even things like Atlas Shrugged and things like that. And it's opening eyes for people um, and maybe opening doors for different types of films in the future, too. Are you excited about that? Yes, uh, definitely, because uh, these filmmakers are so smart. It's, it's The director is Lee Scott, um, and Eliza Swinton is the producer. And, and, you know, Imaginarium, the, the company that um, they have, they're really they're doing everything themselves in their small studio in Connecticut. And it, it's really unbelievable what they've done for this movie and um, the buzz they've gotten, the cast they got attached to it. Uh, I think the trailer looks fantastic. And all the special effects and all the things that they did, you know, without a Hollywood budget, you know. I, I don't know exactly what their budget was. It was, you know, substantial compared to some other films, but, you know, it's not a Hollywood picture. It's not a studio thing. And I think that they're, you know, they set it up so that they can really compete. Um, so, I'm, you know, I'm really proud of this project and... Um, I hope that a lot of people will come out in Arizona, you know, bring the family. It's a PG film, so it's fun for everybody, and, you know, I I can't stress that more, you know, if you want something fun to do on Friday, and uh, go out to the Harkins Theater, and tickets are on sale right now, actually. Jessica, I know we didn't talk ahead of time about this. Was this filmed in Norwich, by any chance? Um, it was filmed in Norwalk, Connecticut. Oh, Okay. Um, and Bridgeport, Connecticut, and actually my hometown of Easton, all over Connecticut. Um, and uh, they're little; they have a little teeny studio. It's in Norwalk. So, That's unbelievable. Um, I'm not sure if you've ever heard of it. Connecticut's such a small state. Um, well, yeah, I used to work in Connecticut. My wife was an anchor in Hartford, and I used to work in um, the Mystic Stonington area. So, and I know there was a, a studio near Sonalist, which was near Nor- Norwich. Uh, it's a it's a big arts area there, obviously. Um, so you yes, got to and, shoot this near your hometown then? Yeah, I didn't shoot actually in my hometown, but I got to stay with my parents when I was filming, which was, they were so happy and they were thinking, oh, are you going to move home from Los Angeles now? There's a, you know, <laughs> I'm like, I, I can't move home and work on one movie, you know, but, um, <laughs> but it was really nice to be with them and, and not have to fight the LA traffic to get to work, you know, but, um, it's, that's another important thing I think about this film is that the locations are absolutely gorgeous. I, it just, it doesn't look, it doesn't look like anything we've seen because it isn't, you know, it's just uh, these beautiful nooks and crannies of Connecticut that they found and shot. And um, one of my, my dear friends plays Dorothy, Polly Rojas, who I've worked with before. And she's just such an adorable, wonderful, talented, beautiful person. And I'm so proud of her for, taking on this unbelievable part of Dorothy. I mean, what a what a part to play. And she, I think she did a fantastic job. I've only seen a little bit of stuff, but from what I've seen, I'm so proud of her. She's unbelievable. Jessica, I don't know much about your career, so I'm going to ask you just flat out. Is this is this the film for you? Is this your, your uh, biggest role to date? <laughs> yeah, I, I would say definitely yes. 
Um, I've done some other exciting projects that are going to come out this year, um, but this, you know, this is the big one for now. And um, you know, I, I also write and I also produce. Uh, I did a comedy with Jason Hughes called Agua Caliente. I'm super proud of, um, and so we're going to be promoting that pretty soon. Um, and I have a movie that's on Netflix called A War, which I also wrote, produced, and acted in. Uh, so if you want to see that, <laughs> it's available. Um, and, um, yeah, but Witches, I am so proud of. I, You know, it's really something that I hope that everyone gets a chance to see and bring the whole family. And um, Now, you're not getting out to Arizona for this, are you? I am coming, yes. I'm going to be there Friday. Oh, you uh, you don't know what you're missing. I mean, this is the time of year, Jessica, if you're going to come to Arizona. It? Oh, it's gorgeous. It's, it'll be about 68 degrees today. Beautiful. Oh, nice. Yeah, it's a little chilly today in um, Los Angeles and, like, rainy, which we don't get much rain, but this is the time of year. So, yeah, I'm looking forward to some dry weather. <laughs> yeah, we had it yesterday. We had some rain yesterday. Hey, look, now we get to follow your career. We hope to see you in Phoenix. And um, best you. of luck. And uh, next time you get a big project going, let's get you on the show one more time, okay? Oh, thank you. And anyone that wants to come out, it's uh, Harkins Theaters. They can look online for Dorothy and the Witches of Oz. And the big premiere is going to be at the Superstition Springs location. That sounds like a lot of fun. And, it, and the movie seems like a blast. And I, when I saw the title, I, I have little kids, and I was saying, well, I don't know. But I, I saw the trailer, and it looked like it's fantastic. Well, come on out. I'll get you tickets if you want to, you know, message me after we talk. And if you want to come, I'll send you all the information for all the, you know, parties. and. <laughs> well, it, it sounds really good. And I, I hope you enjoy your stay here in Arizona, and we'll, we'll stay in touch. Thank you. Uh, Jessica Thank you Sonneborn, so much for having me on. Thank you for being on, Jessica.